Hello everyone, in this video we are going to talk about an important cause of a secondary headache. This is our second video on secondary headache. First ma'am, we have already discussed on giant centiporal arthritis. You video ma'am, we are going to talk about pseudo tumor cerebri. Our pseudo tumor cerebri as a part of it as it's got a very odd implication or so it's got a very detail or so but we are basically discussing over the portion of headache boy headache boy regarding headache pseudo tumor cerebri what are the causes behind pseudo tumor cerebri if person is is coming to a symptom with headache some say raise intracranial tension to symptom near iron about sony how can we rule out pseudo tumor cerebri and what is the treatment modalities that is performed here this is what we will be discussing. So, pseudo-tumor cerebri is not the name of the pseudo, tumor and cerebri. So, we have symptoms here. This is the tumor back of the tumor, but actually there is a tumor. So, why is it like this? Because this patient is usually present with headache. They are present with papillodema. So, here they have fever. So, headache is papillodema. Probably raise ICT back of the tumor. Now, there is a tumor back of the focal neurological deficit. But there is absence of focal neurological deficit. Hence, this condition is known as pseudo-tumor cerebri. So, pseudotumor cerebrum, there is feature of headache, there is papillodema, there is no focal neurological deficit as well as the ventricles are also normal, but yes, there is evidence of raised ICTP. Usually, it is seen in female, you female are young female are also and they are typically obese female. So, female are seen in young obese females. The clinical feature is headache and papillodema. The reason why there is a pseudotumor cerebrum in ICP body is the reason for this is it is because of decrease in CSF absorption. Now, we have CSF absorption here. Gradually, the CSF pressure will start to build up because the CSF starts accumulating within the ventricles and within the subarachnoid space and that will result into increased pressure. And that will result into stretching of the meninges and because of that, the person might develop headache. So, one of the pain-sensitive structures is dural veins as well as this person also meninges are also pain-sensitive and the dura matter is pain-sensitive because of this reason, the person will develop headache. What is the reason for the raise in ICP? The reason for the raise in ICP is because of decrease in CSF absorption. So what are the factors that will prevent the CSF absorption? Let us focus on that. So it can be the etiologies or magic. The most common etiology is idiopathy, where we do not know actually what is the cause behind the obstruction. So if the person is developing obstruction to CSF flow and that is manifesting with headache, with papillodema but absence of focal neurological deficit then probably you mentioned like pseudo tumor cerebrae cause or chandai jada hari cause hai bete na bani pish that is idiopathic and it is the most common type and is to patient ala we call it idiopathic intracranial hypertension so the pseudo tumor cerebrae with unknown etiology is also called as idiopathic intracranial hypertension or go say the another common cause is superior societal sinus obstruction so as we know the CSF is being absorbed absorbed at the level of superior societal sinus our amro key currently superior societal sinus my obstruction boy then it will also result into raise ICP what are the causes behind superior societal sinus obstruction one of them is hypercoagulable states of hypercoagulable states making also clots are forming within superior societal sinus because of the stasis which is already occurring in the veins so veins are already stasis virus just currency plus you mentioned hypercoagulable states so just currency this this man csf absorption like they impair god rasa that condition will result into pseudo tumor cerebri so what are the causes behind this hypercoagulable state one of them is oral contraceptive pills malignancy lepani but also pregnancy lepani but also antiphospholipid antibody syndrome lepani but also in all this condition there is hypercoagulability that is resulting into stasis along with that the stasis of blood in the superior cervical sinus will contribute to formation of clots within the within the veins and that will impair the csf absorption it can also be secondary to the meningitis. So meningitis can also result into superior societal sinus obstruction and that would result into raise ICP eventually causing headache with papillodema with absence of focal neurological deficit. The another common cause is iatrogenic or drug induced. So there is drug induced there are so many causes but I am only talking about the important causes. Just my subway one the important cura I may already know which is hypervitaminosis A. So usually it is a typical history. There is a female, I know, who has a key on sorry, she is coming to me with multiple acne or iron vas. So I am giving certain drugs, right? So you drug or let's say, while I improve by it, okay? Then, so acne like resolve by a certain drug or male day, the drug or say, while I resolve by it. So she is going to dermatologist, which is also known as cosmologist. So dermatologist has a new answer. Dermatologist level like a prescribe on it. You take vitamin A, vitamin A go multiple role or on it. It will also prevent acne. It will also be skin like glow panic or something. So he is giving him topical vitamin A as well as vitamin A. I mean, it's a capsule serpent the rest again and this patient thinking that vitamin a lay was going to improve it is some of us is intoxicating himself or herself with 
भिटामिन है क्या सो डर्मेटोलॉजिस्ट ने तो ठीक प्रेसक्राइब कर बट यो पेसेंटला अज राम देखने वाले वहाँ के भू इज इंटक्सिकेटिंग हिमसेल्फ विथ भिटामिन ए एंड बिकज अफ दि सोल रिजन द पर्सन विल डिप डेवलप हाइपर भिटामिन ओसिस ए एंड दैट विल रिजल्ट इन टू भिटामिन एक्सेस अफ भिटामिन ए इज नट गुड है सो भिटामिन ए को एक्सेस भाई स्लाइटली एक्सेस भाई भी हो मे में होता दैट विल कम्प्रो दैट विल रिजल्ट इन टू सीमटम्स अफ सूडो ट्यूमर सेरेब्रा सो आइट्रोजेनिक में एट हाइपर भिटामिन ए होता अर्क एक्सपायर टेट्रासाइक्लिन हाई सो एक्सपायर टेट्रासाइक्लिन खाए हैं इट कैन रिजल्ट इन टू सूडो ट्यूमर सेरेब्रा इट कैन अल्सो हेपन ड्यू टू क्विनोलॉन्स हाई ड्रग्स लाइक क्विनोलो एंड इट कैन अल्सो हेपन विथ विथ लिथियम लिथियम एज अ ड्रग है इट इज कजिंग मोर हार्म दैन कजिंग बेनिफिट सो लिथियम को साइड इफेक्ट बने को इट कैन अल्सो रिजल्ट इन टू सूडो ट्यूमर सेरेब्रा आई हेव मेड अ डिटेल भिडियो अन लिथियम तो हेन मन है तो हे अर्ग एमाडारोन्स कराई सो वर द कज अफ सूडो ट्यूमर सेरेब्रा द मेन मूल कज के बुझ्पो देर इज डिक्रीज इन सी एस एफ एब्जन एंड दैट इज रिजन टू रेज आई आईसीपी इट कैन बी आइट्रोजेनिक इट कैन बी ड्यू टू ड्रग इंड्यूस्ड ड्रग लाइक हाइबर भिटामिन एस ए इट कैन बी ड्यू टू टेटरसाइक्लिन इट कैन बी ड्यू टू क्विनोलॉस और इट कैन अल्सो हेपन ड्यू टू सुपर सजाइटल साइनस अब्सट्रक्शन विच इज अकर्ंग सेकेंडरी टू हाइपर को एवल स्टेट और सेकेंडरी टू मेनजाइटिस इन अल दिस कंडीस द पेशेंट विल डेवलप रेज आईसीपी बिकज अफ दिस रेज आईसीपी इट विल स्ट्रेस द ड्यूरा मैटर एंड दैट विल रिजन टू हेड एक विथ पैपलोडियम बट देर इज एब्सेंस अफ फोकल न्यूरोलॉजिकल डेफिट एंड द वेन्ट्रिकल्स आर नर्मल इन Size. This condition is known as pseudo tumor cerebri. It's like treat key on it. As CSF not getting absorbed, I'm making on it. So CSF co production line is coming on it. So we can decrease the CSF production by giving a drug called as acetazolamide. And this is the treatment that is usually prescribed in patient of uh, pseudo tumor cerebri. So acetazolamide is a carbonic anhydrase inhibitor. It will inhibit the CSF formation. It will decrease the formation of CSF, and hence it will relieve the symptoms of pseudo tumor cerebri. So next video will be starting on the primary headache. So secondary headache, we have uh, we have started with headache. Headache, ma'am. The causes of headache. Go back, ma'am. Kurare. We also discuss about the etiology behind different type of headache based on International Headache Society classification. This will be discuss important causes of secondary headache. So secondary headache, ma'am. We discussed already on giant cell temporal arthritis. Then in this video, we also talked about pseudo tumor cerebri. The next video will be talking on primary headache. As we know, the most common cause of primary headache is tension type headache. And the most important cause, eh? Jun sabele misconceptualized garsa. That is migraine. So first video will be making. And tension type attack. Then the next video will be talking about migraines, and we'll, we'll, we will also be talking about trisomical autonomic cephalgia. Go bare mein kura rona. Where we'll be talking about cluster type attack and SCU anti go bare mein kura rona. So thank you very much.